Pontiac women's basketball player, K player Katie Carroll is graduating next week, and after four years of basketball, Carroll finally has a summer off. As Eric Dobratz reports, the mechanical engineering major is not going to sit back and relax. She's going to see America. I'm bad at time off. I always like to do stuff. Over the last four years, Katie Carroll has been busy. Now that her basketball career is over, she's going to try something new. Biking across the country. It's a whole different type of uh, in shape. Uh, basketball is more like sprinting, jumping. This is more endurance. I mean, today I went on a bike ride that was four and a half hours. Carol decided to make this 1,400 mile cross country trip after stumbling upon Bike to Build on Instagram. Bike to Build is an organization that has service oriented cycling trips that benefit affordable housing. I've never ridden a road bike before um, about three months ago. And there's definitely been a bit of a learning curve. Learning all the gears, how to clip in my shoes, uh, even like how to change this flat tire. I've gotten two flat tires, so that took me a little bit of time to figure out. After signing up for the trip last fall, Carol was required to raise $4,500 and bike at least 500 miles. She started training right after basketball season ended in March. Today I biked 65, which is my furthest yet. Um, usually I just do whatever fits into my class schedule. The trip starts June 3rd in Providence and ends August 17th in Seattle. The group consists of 30 cyclists between the ages of 18 and 24 at varying skill levels. The day starts about 6 a.m. and then we bike until 2. It's kind of at your own pace, so if you want to stop throughout the day, if you bike fast and want to stop at places, you can do that. We're looking to start through the mountains, uh, through New York, and then we're going to hit like the plains through the Midwest and kind of stay with that for a long time. After a couple months of training, Carol says she's ready to go. I know I'm going to have the entire summer free, so I figure, like, I'm not regretting it or anything. I'm looking forward to it, actually. So has she thought about what it's going to be like to finish this long road trip? Probably just like a sense of accomplishment, honestly. It's such a long journey. Um, I feel like with any journey, there's going to be hard stuff. There's going to be good stuff. And then by the time you just finish, you're just proud of yourself. On the road in Hamden, I'm Eric Dobrads for the Sports Edge.